Hey, Tim DeStacio here. It's Psychrometric Saturday, and today we're talking about one of my favorite topics, which is dehumidification. Now, if we remember, in the psychrometric chart, the higher we are in the chart, the more moisture we have in the air. It's sort of like having a lot of moisture in this container. And then when we start removing that moisture during the air conditioning process, we're going to end up at a lower level in the chart. So say for example here, this is our typical return air temperature, 75 degree dry bulb, somewhere around a 60 degree dew point. And the air coming out, our supply air temperature, is around 55 degree dry bulb and 55 degree dew point. So what happened here? Well, our supply air temperature is not only cooler than our return air temperature, so we've removed heat in the air conditioning process, but if you notice, it's also at a lower level in the psychrometric chart when we're talking about moisture. So not only do we cool the air, we also removed moisture, we dehumidified the air. So where did that moisture go? Obviously we started out with this much moisture and we ended up with less moisture. What happened? Well, that is a condensate that runs out of your drain. It's just the same thing as me pouring out a little bit of this liquid out of this container. I started out with more and now I have less. And that is the dehumidification process. And next time we're going to talk about how the cooling and dehumidification process happens and what happens in between. So stay tuned for next time. Thanks for watching Psychrometric Saturday.